are you, Bobby? Hi, Cam. You want to go for a ride? Sure, Cam. Jump in. <laughs> Hello, YouTube world. Uh, here I am in my new Sarah, which I love, it's a little row. And I got my Woods coffee. And we're having a family day. And today is Sunday, so that means tomorrow is Monday, and that means our mystery boxes ship out. And last night, I had a dream that I got the one of a kind Black Ops uh, Be Sporty. And it was magical, and I'm hoping it's a sign. But that's just because I want it so bad. <laughs> so, we'll see. Um, right now we are going to Walmart, I believe, to look for more stuff for Kate's Easter Basket. If you follow us on Instagram, which is, is it Blondie and the Beast or Blondie and Beast? I don't know, I'll link it down below. Um, I got some stuff for his Easter basket, a lot of troll stuff. Um, he really likes trolls because he loves to sing and dance, so I go a little overboard as far as uh, gifts go. He's going to have a huge Easter. And I will have a video um, showing how I put his Easter basket together once I have everything for it. Um, so hopefully we can find some stuff. I went to Kmart yesterday and I had a branch doll, uh, which I think he would love, and they had a biggie like hug stuffed animal guy that talks, but I really wanted to get him a branch um, stuffy plush thing and they'd have it. Kmart was pretty bare as far as troll stuff went. I didn't realize it was so popular, like everything was sold out. The branch doll I got was the last one, and I'm glad it was branch. So we're gonna go to Walmart and we will see what they got. <sighs> oh yeah, look at these. Those are cute eggs, and I think he would use them. I wish they had a branch basket. This would be perfect. But there's no way all his Easter stuff's gonna fit in here. Hanging out at my mom's house. Um, I was cleaning the car and using my parents' trash to throw everything out. And there was like, probably like an entire garbage bag of stuff in the car. And I hate that. So I finally got to clean it out. And my mom's giving Kate a bath because while I was cleaning it out, I was bribing him with Skittles to be okay. And he got all sticky. So now I'm just hanging out at my mom's house. Today's my grandma's birthday. Um, she would have been 95 today. And then we're gonna go bring flowers to her bench um, instead of a tombstone. At the cemetery, we got her a bench. It's really pretty, I'll show it to you later. My grandma was my everything. And her name was Iris Rose. And this, I got for her. And, um, she hated tattoos. She was alive when I got it. She loved it. <laughs> um, my middle name I named after her. So, there's Brodus, Mr. Great Pyrenees. And my kitty cat Marge, who didn't get to come with me when I moved out. Marge, okay, well she's running away. Typical Marge. So, I'm gonna go help with the bath. Hi, this is my old room, all my stuff's everywhere. Oh, there's a Disney Dooney and Burke. Um, Sally, my parents are starting to empty it out now to make it a grandkid room. Um, that was in my mommy's room when she was a little girl. Princess Diana, because I loves her. <sighs> Accurate, love that. This is my closet. And this is still here from when I was like, Mom, how old was I when I made these Furby things? Yeah. How old was I? What? When I did the Furby stuff. I don't know, I, I don't know when, whenever Furby came out. Okay, here's these. 13, 14, this is my goal. And let me see. I made it, you guys. I made my goal height. This is my fairy godmother. Everyone thinks it's creepy, but I always loved it. And this is the wallpaper that my bed was right here, and when they moved it, my cat came in all angry. 
I think so it's gone and just shredded it. So they're gonna have to do new wallpaper, but they were going to anyway, cause they wanna make it a unisex, unisex grandkid room because kid's a boy. And um, they have Alice Riker and Carly. Right, Carly are in California and Alice is here and she's my goddaughter. And she wanted, she got to go through my room and pick everything she wanted and she picked a lot of stuff. Out in Cade's room, oh, I have the flashlight on. Somebody is, uh, are you helping mama put away laundry? Is that what you're doing? Got some mini bees up there. Wow. Light? Oh yeah. It's a lot of stuff, Kate Kakako. <laughs> da. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so home now. I uh, didn't end up filming at my grandma's bench because it was sad and it felt weird to like take out the phone and Hey everybody, you know, everybody was kind of mourning. She was the best. And um, we all miss her very much. So, when I got home, this amazing, wonderful, super great, perfect pink lady messaged me and she said, um, she has a fairy tale, I'll be right back. And I got it. And I wasn't thinking I was going to be able to because I'm pretty poor right now with my husband's tooth situation, situation, situation. And he said, I, what happened is I already was like, oh, I can't get it. And so I sent a screenshot of the, the bag to my friend, Courtney, but actually I sent it to Leo and I was like, he said back and he because he already knew I like already told her no and then once he saw the screenshot I was like no you need to get it and he said it'll be your Mother's Day gift so eee! fairy tale will be right back <sighs> ah, <Katie! laughs> ah! so that's good news and the placement is absolutely positively perfect and she gave me an amazing wonderful deal because she knew how much I wanted it and I'm so Pink ladies like that are just, ah, uh, she's wonderful. Now I'm just waiting for hubby to get home so we can eat. Oh, let me show you what I got today for Cade. Okie dokie, so we got these from Walmart and they're only 88 cents. I'm gonna fill them with like Skittles, M&Ms maybe. Um, a couple of them I'll put like a dollar bill in so he can put that in his bank. This guy. Talk control at Biggie and what's that guy's name? Mr. Dinkles. And he, um, he. Hug time! Hug time! He talks. <laughs> and then we got this today at Target. It was on sale, but I have to go return it because it's not the Blu ray I thought it was. And it's not, so we have to take that back and get the Blu ray one. Then we have Branch. And I need to find some more like this. So he was the last one at Kmart. And look at this. Last one, but it happened to be him. So even though this is kind of icky, I had to get it. Because this is Kate. he's Kate's favorite. Um, there have been rumors that Guy Diamond is at Target. So we're going to go to Target to get Guy Diamond. Hopefully, or maybe I'll just have my mom and dad get him Guy Diamond for... Easter, because I don't think, I think Leo thinks we're pretty much done as far as Kate's Easter basket goes. We still need to get the basket. And then this little thing with a stamper. So I have to return this for the Blu-ray, and then we have a Cars bubble blower. Like, it's a Disney Cars, and you hold it, and it blows bubbles outside gun thingy, which I think he'll like. So this, 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 the bubble blower, Blu-ray, and then I'm so excited for him to actually like look for eggs this year. So I know that's kind of a lot for an Easter basket. Actually, we found a lot of cute branch Easter baskets, but I couldn't get them because all of his Easter goodies weren't fit. So 
I have to find like an extra large Easter basket. I'm gonna have to have Leo hide all his Easter goodies from me because I will give in and give it to him early. I'd like to get him a Poppy one, like the little troll action figures and a guy diamond and I think they have a Harper one. I'm not sure which other ones they make. So far I've only seen um, guy diamond and branch, but no, I saw Poppy just not in person. My um, sister-in-law got her daughter one. So we shall see. Um, again, I'm gonna do a whole Easter, what's in Kate's Easter basket video. And I know I went over the top. I do for every holiday. Um, he got Valentine's gifts too. It's just, it's how I was raised. My parents spoiled my brother and I like that. And um, Leo didn't grow up that like spoiled like that. So he thinks it's weird and unnecessary. And so we're trying to meet somewhere in the middle because like he said the Easter budget should be $10 and I was thinking like 100 so we were way off. But I think there's a difference between raising your kids to be spoiled and raising them to be spoiled brats. My brother and I were still very appreciative of everything we got. We were never bratty and we always loved our parents. We always talked to them with respect. We got good grades. We never went out and partied or did drugs or were promiscuous. So, I mean, we were still really good kids. And hopefully you will be too, huh, mister? Anywho, so excited about to be right back. Ah. Um, I'd end up with...